there's drugs everywhere. In the news, in the movies, in the sports world, and maybe even in your body. So, the corporation has decided that as a security measure, all employees must undergo a urinalysis test this afternoon. Now, this test oh, is... Oh, no. Objection. What if they find traces of that joint I smoked at Patty's wedding two years ago? Stop. Wait. Now you don't have to sweat if your boss makes you pee, because now there's Pseudo-Pee, the amazing new laboratory breakthrough that looks and smells and tests just like real urine. Just attach the convenient pseudo pee plastic pouch to the inside of your leg. Fits easily under even the tightest blue jeans or pantsuit. Then when it's time to go, you simply break the easy lock seal, empty the contents into the specimen bottle, and presto! Like magic, your reputation is completely clean and clear, just like pseudo pee. Well, doctor? Ah, no drugs here. I can't find a thing. You're clean. Thank you, pseudo P. Yes, from the laboratory to the lavatory, it's an amazing breakthrough, pseudo P. Available now with or without a prescription, pseudo P. First, the basketball pump. Then, the innovative running pump. Now, pump technology goes a step beyond the Revere Pump. For your hair, right? The Revere Pump gives your hair a custom look and custom fit with a breakthrough dual chamber. One. To pump up your hair and make it bigger. And a second pump chamber. To make my neck smaller because that makes my hair look bigger. Awesome, huh? The Revere Pump. And it's got nothing to do with sports, thank God. Warning, pumping your hair too often can lead to swelling of the brain, which can cause brain to... What? Nothing. Tell me. No. The what? Revere Pump. It's good for the environment, and nothing had to die to make the stuff. Joe. Joe. Did you enjoy your dinner? Huh? Oh. Oh, yeah, Mom. Sorry. Then why were you staring off into space like that? Oh, I was just thinking. I wonder what it would be like if the Beatles and the Three Stooges made a record album together. I wonder... I wonder. White Tower presents for the first time the Three Stooges meet the Beatles. E A B B E B B I Bicky by B O Bo Bicky by Bo B U Boo Bicky by Bo Boo. Never before available. The Fab Four plus the Three Stooges. A B C D. C-H-A-C-E-C-C-I-C-C-I-C-O-So-C-C-I-So-C-U-S-U-C-C-I-So-Su Mo is bad to me, you know He slaps us all the time, you know He said so Oh, Larry, come here I got slapped by Mo cause I'm Larry Fine Oh, a wise guy, eh? Come here, you little porcupine If you think the Beatles' haircuts were lowbrow Wait till you hear them now As the Three Stooges meets the Beatles Bring my friend, I said you pulled up the rock Dr. Howard, Dr. Fine, Dr. Howard. We'll have you fixed up in a jiffy. <laughs> I didn't see any airport. The three stooges meet the Beatles. Hello. 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 Quiet. The three stooges meet the Beatles. Order now for a limited time and get a special bonus record. The three stooges meet the Clash. So you've got to let me know. Is it Shemp or is it Mo? John, Paul, George, Ringo, Larry, Curly, and Mo with a special guest appearance by Shemp. <laughs> the Three Stooges meet the Beatles. More BC Entertainment exclusively from Whitel. You can tell it's Whitel. It'll never sell. Wow. So that's what it would be like. Tonight, the Fool's Cable Network joins special guest host Peter Falk as he visits the people, the places, the peace and quiet of a typical rustic small town in New England, Athol, Massachusetts. Hi, welcome to Athol, Massachusetts. Ah, this is nice. Very, very nice. Now, take a look at this beautiful firehouse here. That's beautiful. You know, it's probably been here ever since they built it. Yep. And over here is the Athol Post Office, and uh, here's the hardware store. Actor Peter Faw takes you on a tour of Athol, Massachusetts. Oh, and the people here are so laid back. So simple, so direct. I, excuse me, excuse me, sir. I am sorry to bother you, sir. Could you tell me where you bought that ice cream cone, sir? No! Oh, see what I mean? That's beautiful. Join us tonight for Falk in Athol and see the peace and beauty that is New England. That's a fine-looking baby, if you don't mind my saying so, ma'am. What's his name? None of your business. Beautiful. Just beautiful. That's beautiful. You haven't seen New England until you see this heartwarming documentary. Don't miss Falk in Athol. 
Tonight, exclusively on the Fool's Cable Network. Boston's first and funniest children's television clown has grown up to tackle the most ambitious role of his career. What did you say, Godfather? He says, you come to me at my daughter's wedding and you ask me for justice? Willie Whistle is the Whistling Godfather. Sonny, Papa says, how many times do I have to tell you? Never discuss family business in front of strangers. See Willie Whistle as you've never seen him before. He says, make him an offer. They can't refuse. Hear Willie Whistle as you've always heard him before. Your father says, I never wanted this for you. I always imagined you'd be a Senator Corleone, or a Governor Corleone, or a Monsignor Corleone, Congressman Corleone. He's one of the mob's most powerful men, but no one knows him as Don. They just call him Willie. So get this, Godfather. The Jamo comes up and says to me, I want exclusive distribution rights. I says, distribute this. Ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. <laughs> Whoopi Cushion Films, in association with Rubber Nose Releasing, presents Willie Whistle as the Whistling Godfather from Clown International. Rated G-. No one under six admitted. Starts Friday at the Suspender Cinemas 1 and 2, the Big Shoe Mall, Circus Cinemas, and the Baggy Pants Plaza.